Hey everyone, welcome back to Rayman 2. Uh, in this episode, what I'm going to do... Fuck, I forgot to look up where the missing lums are in the man -ear Hills. Doesn't matter, we're going here. This is the Sanctuary of Stone and Fire. Probably the lengthiest and most involved level in the game. Honestly, when I was a kid, this was like the hardest level. Uh, I just couldn't make it through this shit. But now, things are different. Things are different, and we will see what we can, what we can pull off here. Of course, I have enough lums again. Like usually, if you're not being an idiot or not being a kid, like when I was a kid, I used to get stuck here. Uh, you'll always have enough lums, but yeah, this this level, we'll get to it. We'll get through it. Um, there is kind of an annoying mechanic here, which I don't know with the spacebar controls and shit how it will work but it's okay we'll get through it I do like again like overall this level it's very well designed um, it has like everything basically warning labyrinth exactly robber routers they're not kidding when they say this is a labyrinth so anyways by the time you s you're seeing this video uh, I will be off on holiday slash vacation you know people were roasting me when I was streaming that I, th I think I've talked about this right that I say everything American the, like the American way except I say holiday which should be vacation um, which is true Listen, I'm not denying it. Um, I've gotten to calling it vacation. It's how I said it on my Outlook at work. And that was stupid. I could have at least gotten the lump. Whatever. Um, I did change it on my Outlook. Even though, again, I work for a British company. So 90% of people use the English uh, ways of saying things. I was I was being an asshole, a little fuckhead, and I said it just to be contrary. And you know, I think the thing is what we do here. And the trick here. What? Okay. That was. Why does he keep letting go? What? Am I stoned? I think I'm stoned. Why is he letting go? Rayman is being a bitch right about now. Uh, it's strange. That shouldn't happen. Anyways, we got the little secret thing unlocked. So the cage, if I remember correctly, is under the bouncing thingy. So yeah, once you have this unlocked, you can get this lum and this. The golden glove. Uh, what this is, is it boosts your uh, shots, but the deal with it is... God, the music is awesome here. This stage does have sick music. Um, the deal with this is, if you get damaged, you lose it. Three hits and it's gone. Believe me, it's not that significant, uh, the damage increase, but... Just nice, seeing how long you can keep your little buff. Do you see that? Okay, the lock on is going all over. The Why are my shots missing? Excuse. Damn. That was fucking insane. Alright. So what we gotta do, we'll just move along here. And man, is this going to be difficult, remembering everything in the stage. Oops. That was not... <laughs> that was not it. So what happened? There it is. Okay, so I managed to quickly lose my buff. So the deal with this stage of the game is... Is you have these plums... Uh, that you can navigate... By shooting in the opposite direction... And this is the shit you have to use to navigate through most of the level. Uh, 
This is what I mean by when I said this level has kind of an annoying mechanic. And it's this. Uh, this plum shit used to, like, really wreck me as a kid. Um, I, like, didn't get it. I think what we have to... Yeah, I'll go here first. This one you can get through like this, by climbing along. Except I think you have to reverse out. Because there's stuff way back. Yeah, actually a lot of stuff. We'll do that in a bit. Um, we'll just pick the, sh pick the stuff up here. I'm saying stuff a lot. Okay. So this is what happens, you got enemies too. Which ain't good. Okay, I'm sure there's something here. This is here for a reason. 100%. It's not here for a reason. Strange. Okay, doesn't matter. I'm gonna have to come back here. Because this is the way forward, right? This is the way forward, yeah. Yeah, and you can grab it as well. Yeah. Oh yeah, you can use it in combat. The plum is versatile. I don't know why plums. This game really... champions plums for some reason. Um, it's a good fruit. Listen, I ain't lying. I like a good plum. That was such a weird statement, but, hey, it's true. Fucking hell, these guys spawn fast. So why I'm coming he back here is because we are not done with this area. Um, as I said, this place is very involved. I love the music. Can't stress it enough, because... Oh, shit. I'm gonna have to... Mm, okay, that's gonna be annoying. Okay, you're gonna have to bear with me here a little bit. Um, God, this is gonna be a long episode. Uh, considering that I'm... 10 minutes in already, almost. And we haven't done... Jack shit. It's a little bit concerning. I gotta speed things along. Okay, I'm gonna pick this up. So that I don't... You know, I don't mess it up. Anyways, this is why we gotta go back here. Because if you use the plum... You can reach a shit ton of new areas if the camera decides to cooperate. This is one area. Did I lose the plum? I think I did. It doesn't matter. Because it leads to new areas. Everything in this place leads to new areas. Um, and there's supposed to be... Oh yeah, so he's smart. He thinks he's smart. But he ain't. That was not what... That's not what's meant to happen, I assure you. Uh, you are meant to throw it at this guy's head. Okay, I might be fucked here. So it get, it's, it's supposed to get stuck on his head. If I can manage it. You gotta be like sneaky about it or something. Are you fucking kidding me? Hardest encounter of 2020. Okay, 
at camera, please. Please cooperate. I fuck. How do you do this? I don't remember how you do this. Maybe you can just... I have another idea. Um, cause you can also throw it on the spikes. I'm sure this is what you have to do. Maybe he has a good throwing arm. Yes. And this is what happens. You can platform off of him. Excelente. And he's just stuck like that. Forever. Okay, glad I made it through that. That was more difficult than it should have been, I think. Okay, this bitch better be spawning some serious plums. Oh wait, this is not a plum tree. Anyways, we are not through here because we also have more paths. I think this, that's a cage that I miss quite often uh, in this level. Because I like don't remember doing that section. So yeah, really, again, the thing about this level is the biggest enemy you have is for sure the camera. Uh, because this game has kind of a health fixed camera. Uh, it can get very, very disorienting sometimes. Now it's being okay. Except for the constant disorienting bobbing, which normally it doesn't do. And it's sorry if this is making you sick. Um, this is really testing your, you know, plum navigation skills. All right. No, don't throw it up. Throw it on the spike. And don't miss. Cool. I can't believe I fell off. <laughs> okay. Okay, okay, okay. Never mind. So yeah, this is what this stage is like. It's very easy to get um, distracted. I hella don't remember this section. Holy shit. Um... Oh, you gotta catch it. You throw it on, you catch it. Okay, I got you. Yeah, this, I don't think I've ever done this. Um, we are in uncharted territory. Yeah. Damn, this is cool. I don't know what you do with this. Do you just like use it to boost yourself? I think so. No, 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 no. Don't even think about it. That was an accident. Yep. Unless this leads to where I think it leads. No, it doesn't. Yeah, I've definitely never done this. Um, this is completely new. Well, hey, listen. I don't know how many years later... You can still discover new things. That's what's cool about these games. Alright. I think we're Gucci right there. We can go. Plumb the hell out of here. And get back to the actual way we're supposed to go. Which I haven't done much of so far. Like, actually progressing in the level. Oh wait, isn't there a trick here or something? Or does... I think we might have just gotten that cage. That's under the bouncy thing. Oh, you can also go this way. I remember. I don't remember what's over there, honestly. Oh shit, don't knock it off. Just because I don't want to 
wait for another one to spawn. I think what I'm gonna do is we'll go that way. Yeah, I'm hella getting distracted. Listen, if there is no, like, whining coming from down here, and there isn't, we did get the correct cage. Cage the elephant. That's a good band. Cage the elephant. Oh wait, this just leads over here. Oh, fuck, I'm stupid. Okay, apparently my navigation skills need some work too. It's cool. I think that was not maybe a big surprise for some people. Oh yeah, you know what? I do have something to discuss. You know, I was streaming on Twitch. This I'm recording this on Tuesday. Uh, I was streaming the level 1 uh, fists only Dark Souls 2 challenge. Man, listen. Um, or not level one, but mm, I hate when it moves like that. But uh, base level, there is no actual level one characters in Dark Souls 2. And man, is that game sometimes difficult to uh, not rage at. Uh, I got, I'm, I'm stuck. I'm stuck on the Iron Keep uh, because because of the stupid adaptability mechanic. If you were there, you know what I'm talking about. The issue is that Dark Souls 2 makes it very difficult to dodge. Now combine that with enemies that basically track like crazy. Like the amount of tracking... Okay, we gotta go up first. The amount of tracking that enemies do is insane. Combine that with the lack of ADP and things get very, very annoying. Um, so, as of today, Tuesday morning, um, I am undecided on whether I'm going to continue. Uh, I will try to make a decision. The reason is just like, again, like, there's a point after which things just become unfun, you know, and part of streaming is that you're supposed to enjoy it yourself as well, um, and I was not enjoying yesterday's stream, oh yeah, this is this section, yeah, as you can see that like this, this stage goes hard. Uh, it's not fucking around. That's what I'm talking about. There's everything. Buzz that door open. Bring the spike down. Now this section I do remember, so... I've definitely... Made it through this one. There's a bunch of cages here. Whoops. Luckily you cannot lose lums. They just kind of hang out in the air there. And that would be a real motherfucker. So again. I am undecided. Very undecided. Fuck, wh why can't I navigate? Whatever. The only question is like, what do, you, what do I stream if not Dark Souls 2? And this is zombie. <laughs> I keep dying in the stupidest way. Have you guys noticed that I'm like, unable to die in normal ways in this game? Well, actually we haven't died yet, have we? Um... Unless you count the drunk episode. I think I died there. No, wait, no, I didn't. Did I die? I don't remember that drunk episode too much. I'm only kidding. Of course I remember it. I wasn't that, that drunk. Just a little bit. I 
keep accidentally activating my helicopter. And that's the problem. I think oh yeah yeah yeah. This section is a motherfucker. Where's the cage? Where's the cage? Oh, there it is. And of course you have fire shooting at you, because why wouldn't you? Thanks, camera. What? what? <laughs> I touched the lava, didn't I? I think I did. And there's a tiny spider up there. Do you guys see that? Yeah, I can hear it shuffling. Oh, fuck. Okay, I'm losing a lot of HP. Um... Hopefully I ain't gonna die here. First of all, that would be very embarrassing. Uh, dying to a kid's game. God damn it! Okay, I think there's actually a chance of me dying here. Um, listen, we'll chalk it up to this stage being fairly complicated. If I do end up dying... Which definitely... And there's a tiny spider as well. Which definitely will not happen. But I'm just preparing you. I'm loading up the excuses in, ca in case it does. Um, you know how we do. I think... Okay, we've already been there. Cool. This does lead to the shell section, right? If I remember correctly. Fuck off. Oh! Oh, I remember. Yeah, you gotta... Okay. I got you, fam. Okay, actually... Shit. But I, hear, I heard the spiders respawning, so... If I need HP, I can just farm them. Yeah, what you, what you do here is this. Talk about there's no involved platforming in this game. There is, there is. But these are like really fun, I think. Fun little sections, I think. There we go, there we go. This is what the boy wants to see. I wanna see red. Oh fuck. Alright, I can kill this bitch right now. You remember when... That's how significant the spider killage is. This game really wants you. Oh wait, well, what's over here though? Oh, this is the shell section. But then this one is... Oh! Oh, I thought this led... Okay, never mind. This all good. So what you have right here is a sleeping shell. Yeah, there is a shell section in this level. Not an easy one, apparently. <laughs> yeah, okay, these are difficult to navigate with the keyboard. Easy to overshoot or undershoot, depending. Mmm, okay. Well, I think my HP is going. God damn it, like, okay. This is insane. Uh, this is, okay, listen. I know this is a kid's game. I'm failing at a kid's game, but... It's like, genuinely hard to control this with a keyboard. I don't remember struggling this much with this game. What the fuck? 
I don't remember struggling this much with this game when I was a kid. Maybe if I just don't boost. But then, motherfucker. Oh, this one can jump! This is one of those. Fuck. I forgot these things can jump. I thought you had to use your boost. Yeah. Oh, fucking loop loops. I... I failed to jump there. That was my mistake, I'll be honest with you. Okay. We've arrived at the solution. I know what's up now. You got a yump, as the Swedish say. Uh. Hmm. Hmm, indeed. I'm doing it too late. I mean, too early. Yep. Oh, f <laughs> I remember that. Oh, that's gonna be bad. This is gonna be bad. Um, watch me embarrass myself on a kid's game. This ain't even like... This ain't, this isn't like Crash Bandicoot type stuff. I'm going to be honest with you. Uh, this game is much easier than that. But... Sometimes it likes being a motherfucker. Like asking me to... Navigate. On a super narrow walkway. No! I made it. Oh, thank fuck, I thought... Oh, I was so worried for a second there. I genuinely thought that uh, you'd have to... Um, what you call it? Break it with the shell. Break the door with the shell, but you don't. Alright. This leads you to two whole lums. I heard a cage somewhere. Shit. Did I straight up just fall off? I swear I heard a cage somewhere. We're gonna... Take a look around. Am I deaf or something? Not deaf, but am I stupid? That entire work was for two lums. Damn, this is even worse than I remember. Not worse as in, you know. You know what I mean. Okay, so that was a lot of work. Um, but we're gonna, we're gonna go and get the hell out of here. And continue with the actual stage, because believe it or not, we are nowhere near done with the actual stage. There's plenty left. Plenty left. Oh yeah, there's... This is the freebie cage they give you. Why am I not charging? Excellent. Bueno, excelente. And this is, you know, when I was a kid, this was the, this was the cage I managed to get. And you know, I saw the thing that there's eight of them here, and my mind was like blown. I was like, holy shit! 
Where the hell are there eight cages in the stage? Listen, that was a mistake. But what I was gonna say is I don't trust that they didn't put a yellow lum uh, in that little corner there. So I'm going to, I'm gonna check it out. I don't trust them. I definitely have a feeling. And if they didn't, yeah, they didn't. Oh yeah, you gotta be careful, this is something I didn't explain. That this lava, this like actual lava, it messes with you. Oh shit, this is a... We have an annoying enemy on our hand. How do you kill this guy again? I forgot. So you have this thing. You gotta like lure him out. And that's when you can attack him. It's from the Cave of the Bad Dreams. You know when I was fighting them there and I said that there's an annoying version that comes up later? Uh, this is him. So he's fucking spinning around like a Beyblade. Um, and that's kind of his deal. Genuinely, this was a lot more difficult when I was a kid. <laughs> this one, I was like, fuck. And all that effort... Just so you can make it up some platforms. I like that they bring back the Cave of Bad Dreams music. Um, although, I do have a bone to pick with the Rayman lore here. And like, what the fuck this guy is doing here. Unexplained, you know, lore. It's never a good thing. This is like my favorite section. I don't know why. There's just like this little peaceful ruins section here. With a nice panorama. And then you fall through. Oh yeah, shit. Here comes the difficult part. Okay. Straight up missing the plum. <laughs> what is even happening? There we go. Yeah, this is where things start to get a little bit more difficult. I don't know why. The, I apologize for the screen shaking. Um, There are going to be a few suicide runs here, I think. Did I get them? I think I did. Hell yeah. Expert level. Oh yeah, and you have spikes too. Which you gotta destroy. Listen, this is... I remember this being a lot more difficult. Maybe my years of Dark Souls have honed the boy's skills. Unless you put me near a walking shell, because that's when... That's when things fall apart. Ah, oh, yeah, there's something here. You gotta go. There's another secret section. Right here. Oh, fuck off camera. Seriously? Screwing me like this. Alright. Damn. I 
Okay, and I think the trick here is... Oh, don't... F the trick here is not to fall back down. I didn't know it led back. Uh, that must be the way to actually come back through here. God, this stage is fucking melting my mind. I'm pretty sure I never got this section either. Uh, and what should do, I think? You helicopter your ass right here. Because the other door, the one we passed by, that one doesn't open. And you gotta make it through this place. And what you gotta do is... Throw this. Without letting it go into the fire, because then it gets destroyed. I just threw it into the abyss. I think only if it gets touched by the fire, only then does it go back to the start. Uh, oh shit. Hey, what you gotta do is wait, wait, wait. There we go. Oh, does it not get... Why did I remember it like the fire destroyed it? Legit. That would be an added challenge. Maybe that's too much. They would have done that in Rayman 1, that's for sure. God, Rayman 1. That's a game that's... Not gonna... What? Ke? Um, what's going on? I don't know what's happening. But this better lead to Lums. It's just gonna take me back. It's just gonna take me back, right? Fuck. Okay. Um... Not sure about that one. Oh, it must be if you lose it, right? But then it doesn't go back. It's whatever. Fuck it. Do I know the logic of this? Hell no. But... It doesn't really matter, does it? Please tell me it's still there. Okay. Because you never have to come through this section again. It doesn't work like that. Like backwards, especially. Oh shit, I remember this. Yeah, so what you do? Listen to this shit. You gotta bounce the plum back. You pick this up. You get on the plum. I think we should be okay. Yeah. Quite a section, right? Of course they put enemies here. Because of course... But luckily... We are right here. This is the end of the level. Uh, where the quote-unquote boss of the place is. There is a boss, but it's not... Like, listen, all the sanctuaries have bosses, but... This one is kind of a bitch. There he is. <laughs> I always thought this one looked hella funny. When I was a kid. Maybe you do have to go through this place backwards. It could be a possibility. Yeah, it is. I genuinely don't didn't remember that. Weird. Oh, come on. I fucked it up. Alright, bounce this shit back. Bouncing on your boy's dick. God, this is gonna be a long episode. Maybe the suicide run was a real option here. I think it was. 
how many... Um, okay, I'm missing five lums. That should be doable. I think I generally know that there's still five lums. If I get 50 on this stage, that's gonna be actually amazing, because I've never ever managed it. Should I guess this hit was here for a reason? You can't catch me, little bitch. Yeah, listen. Again. Even after all this time. Are you fucking kidding me? Wait then. What? But where do I go then? Because he cannot make it. Okay, there is no point to that. Okay. I think we're gonna edit. I'm gonna make you watch my run back. There it is. Okay. I was stupid. Ignore me. I legit thought you couldn't make it through that. Oh, that's a freebie. Yeah, because this is where you come back from. And what you gotta do is... First of all, get that lum. We'll, we'll let that go. Alright, let's go. Whoa. Listen, they pulled the Mayan temple trick on you because it actually leads to a different location now. The door. That's the, that's the gimmick, you know. It's like fucking Shulva. More complicated. Did I seriously lose the lum? The plum? Oh no, no I didn't. Oh shit. Okay. That was, <laughs> that was... Ignore that. Oh, this section is a motherfucker. You know what we have to do? Yeah. This ain't easy. Being cheesy. Speaking of cheesy... Hella looks like nacho cheese. Like the movie theater, like, cheap-ass fake nacho cheese. That's some good shit. Oh, what's the deal here? Oh yeah, I kinda remember. There's definitely... <laughs> There's definitely lumps here. I know... Listen, I know how to slow down. Even though slowing down makes you go all kinds of crazy. I need to take it real slow. Because I'm not risking anything, that's for sure. I'm gonna get it. Expert level. Truly expert level. Cool. Uh, okay. Please tell me there's that many lums left. Please tell me there's three here. I only see two. It's making me worried. It is making me very concerned that I missed a single lum somewhere. It's gonna piss me off. Um, if that happens though... It's like, at that point, whatever. Right? There's only so much I can do. The question is, how do you get to it? Probably from here. I think I legit missed a single yellow lump somewhere. Unless the game is gonna save me and there's one left. Uh, when you go to the boss fight. So we activate him. Umber. This dude doesn't do shit. So he just stands there. And what you do is... I think in one of the versions he talks. I seem to remember him speaking. Please tell me there's a single yellow lum here. Oh, I really don't want to go through this entire stage again. 
Because I like legit don't know where I missed one. I think that's what's gonna happen though. Yeah. So he just suicides himself. Oh, there's one here. It's a red one. There it is. I was so worried. You don't even know. That only took like hella long. There are some sections I'm gonna cut out though, so don't worry about it. That walking stage, the walking shell stage, first try. I made it. Get another creepy mask. This one is this one's probably the best one. It looks like there is there was that other game. Where he played as an alien, and that like fruits were the enemies or something, and he looked like that. Or did I just like dream that up in a fever dream? Speaking of fever dreams, damn, his arms are that's a molester arms for sure. Again, strange titties too. Yeah, he is he is not lying. The other the rest of the game has some of the harder um levels. Like now I gotta embarrass myself on this bonus stage. I think I'm just gonna cut this out. Look at how fast I'm doing this. And listen, I I do finger drumming too. So I should be like expert level here. Oh just one time. I made it! I did it! I did it once. I did it one time. That is amazing. You don't get jack shit from it, right? Just HP. Oh, that. Okay, I'll take that. I can't believe I actually did it. Just once. It's probably never gonna happen again. I feel like... I feel like I got carpal tunnel from that. I'm gonna go ahead and wrap it up here. Thank you guys very much for watching this episode of Rayman. Tomorrow we are going to the Echoing Caves. This is a good level. Thanks for watching and goodbye.